Hey guys, so my biggest frustration that I have with marketing today and marketing people is the inability to distinguish between an existing customer and a new customer. And these days we go through the motions so much that nobody ever stops to think about why they're doing it. They don't ever measure the success. They don't ever measure anything. And they just go through the motions of social media just because that's what you do. And the, the people that market to nothing but social media, email lists, all this stuff are marketing to customers they've already got, which is important, but when that's all you do, that's just insane to me. The, the, uh, the, the people that follow you on social media obviously know you, they've heard of you, they follow you. Email lists are people that have, unless you bought the list, if they're opted in, they have people that have heard of you. Again, they know you, they know you're there, they know you're an option. And what, when 100% when of the marketing budget goes toward that and has nothing to do with bringing in new people, that's absolutely insane to me. I don't understand that, that logic. A lot of people just don't think of that. Just don't even, doesn't even cross their mind. Like, wait, who are, we, who are we going after? Who are we trying to bring in the door here? And those same people, if, they're, if you have a great experience, if you show them a great time, they're going to tell their friends that's going to multiply a little bit. But my focus, what I do is the other side. It's about bringing in people that have never heard of you before. So this is through search engines. This is through online reviews. So those two aspects, nobody seems to do a thing about in the bar restaurant business for the most part. Some places do. Most of them don't even know that's an option. And then and they're like, well, it is what it is. I guess we either show up high in Google or we don't. Eh. And it's, it's voodoo to a lot of people, so they don't even pay attention to it. I make sure that all my clients get to the top of the Google results for the words we go after. I make sure that they show up on the map. That whole map search in, in a, a, like a restaurant search, if you're not on that map, you don't exist in that, that, that realm. And uh, uh, online reviews in Google make up two and three of bringing people in the door, the most important, the biggest factor, second to word of mouth. So things that we can manipulate, they're number one and two. So it's, it's, it's not hard to do. It doesn't take a lot of money to do it. You just have to focus on it. Respond to all your online reviews. It's really easy to respond to them. Google, TripAdvisor, Facebook, and Yelp. Just respond. It's all you have to do. And if you're doing it, don't get an intern to do it. Don't get somebody who doesn't know what they're doing to do it. Get, if you're the owner, do it yourself. I know I don't have time. You gotta make time. Get the GM to do it. Get somebody who knows how to do it. There's a very, uh, I just said it's easy, it is easy. But if you have the wrong person doing it, they could accidentally send the wrong message pretty easy as well. So make sure you have someone who knows how to, uh, uh, how to speak, how to, how to say the right words to the right people. And if you have a bad review, of course you're gonna apologize, you're gonna own it, you're gonna get them back in. Do not ignore your positive reviews. Thank these people. These are your fans. These are people that had a great experience. And most of the time, what I've seen is the owners will all only respond to the negatives. So these people that are loving them, hey, you did great, did a great job, ignored. They don't even, they just gloss right over it. Which is again, that's an insane tactic. Respond to these people, thank them. And thank them for your business. That goes so far when someone just sees, oh my God, the owner just thanked me for my review. How awesome is that? That goes so far and it will take you literally 30 seconds to do. So focus on these two things, search engines, online reviews, make sure they're optimized. Make sure that you put as much effort as you possibly can into those two things. When you bring in new people in the door, now you've got more people that are your face, that, that are your regulars that are going to spread your word of mouth. These people multiply your business. So I am a big fan of getting more multipliers in the door who spread the word of mouth, who grow your business for you. So get out of that itty bitty box of marketing to people who already know you, marketing to customers you've already got. Start expanding, start building your business. Hope this helps.